Good morning. It's my honor and privilege to welcome all of you to the eighth edition of the annual flagship conference of Exchange for Media. Uh, it's an extension of Exchange for Media's philosophy of creating a dialogue amongst various stakeholders and finding answers and way forward to some of the market realities that face us. Uh, I would like to welcome uh, special guests who come all the way uh, to be part of the annual conclave. First, because these are guests uh, in the real sense, I'd like to welcome Mr. Harnan Sanchez Nira, I hope you're pr I pronounce your name right, who's the CEO of Harvest Media Intelligence, who's here especially to be part of the Exchange for Media call. Okay. Thank you, sir, for being part of this, and I'd like you to give him a big round of applause. Welcome him. Uh, India is a lot about entrepreneurship, and I'd like to welcome an entrepreneur in the midst of us, Mr. Harkirat Singh, who's the man behind the Woodland brand. Uh, thank you, Mr. Singh, for being part of our conference this year. Uh, uh, we have amongst us Anita Nair, who is the CEO of Harvest uh, Media in India. Uh, thank you, Anita, for being part of the con conference. We have Jasmine Sorabji. Uh, uh, Jasmine is the CEO of OMD in India, and she's come from Mumbai to be making a presentation to you. Uh, thank you, Jasmine, for being part of this. Uh, we also have Mr. Chitranjan Dar, the CEO of ITC Foods. He was in the lounge. I not sure he's come into the uh, room. We have Mr. Gautaman, who's the head of mine here in South Asia. Uh, definitely, uh, I'd like to welcome Mr. Theory Jadot, who's the EVP Emerging Markets and CEO of Starcom Media West Group. And we really look forward to your session, sir. Uh, last but not the least, we have a man that most people in the media business don't uh, seem to ignore for. Uh, and I, I had a lady sitting next to me and uh, Sam quietly sat to her and she asked, so, uh, who are you? And he said, Sam Balsara. She said, oh, oh, you are Sam Balsara. So he suddenly saw a halo around Sam. Uh, thank you for being part of this, Mr. Balsara. Uh, we have uh, Shrikant Shastri, who is the country chair of Vivaki in India. Uh, Mr. Rajiv Verma, who is the CEO of Hindustan Times. And you don't see him much speaking on conferences. He's part of the conference. And... Last but not the least, we have Sami Suneja, the MD of Perfetti Van Mele. I welcome all the speakers to the conclave. It's an interesting time, and uh, it's a time when, in the last one week, we've seen what's happened with the news of the world, uh, the credibility of media, the ethics of media, the ethics of news gathering, the future of media companies, uh, and most of you who are glued onto BBC and CNN would have noticed that uh, Murdoch's uh, bid for taking of B Sky B has been referred to the Competitive Commission. Uh, over the last one week, various Indian media owners have been saying with the consolidation in the distribution space happening, there are groups that own front-end uh, content, they own content production companies, they own distribution, so maybe there should be a Competition Commission of India looking at how such media conglomerates are operating in India and the issue of cross-media holdings. Uh, we've also seen over the last four weeks, uh, we've seen attacks on journalists, we've seen attack uh, leading crime journalists in Mumbai being murdered. We still don't have a word on why and how it happened. But the fact is that media professionals, uh, journalists and media organizations are under increasing fire uh, to, to not do their job to not be honest, and that's not necessarily in form of violence, sometimes in form of advertiser cutting of advertising, uh, so on and so forth. Uh, interestingly, uh, the topic of this year's conclave is reshaping media priorities for the new marketing era, and uh, the current issue of pitch, and we've revamped pitch, the current issue of pitch uh, is marketing lessons from regional champions, and as Amit says, these are the new nirmas. So we have an issue, we have, you know, the Indian consumer is very uh, well-versed and very comfortable with rising Indian brands, whether it's the, uh, you know, Vijon Group or Rupa or Vag Bakri or Krimika, Priya Gold, and I can go on. So the number of Indian brands that are today taking on large, established, 80, 100-year-old MNC brands which have a brand architecture uh, which, is, which is really solid, is tremendous. Uh, so the theme of the conclave and the cover of the pitch magazine in some way have a lot of s similarity. And the latest issue of impact, again as a cover, I was reading it, is about how media brands and how media organizations are trying to change their offerings and not just their look, 
but their offerings, not just changing their brand identity, but changing the DNA of their content, uh, doing an editorial-led uh, brand change, doing an editorial-led makeover, uh, whether it's a news brand or a non-news brand. So like all of you, I look forward to being in the audience, learning from the stalwarts, from the practitioners, from the entrepreneurs, going back uh, uh, hopefully a more knowledgeable person. And uh, uh, it, on the 15th, on Friday, we have the same conclave in Mumbai, and we have an equally impressive line of speakers. We have Mr. Nitin Paranjpe of Levers. We have uh, um, the global CEO of Mindshare, Mr. Dominic Proctor. We have Mr. Mike Cooper, who's the CEO of, uh, of PhD, which is part of the Omnicom Media Group, and many other speakers that I don't want to bore you with, but they are in the uh, in the magazines you'll find their names and on in the evening on 15th we have the 11th anniversary uh, dinner of exchange for media conclave and uh, over the next few months we are also rolling our e event initiatives as per our events calendar so on 27th august saturday we have the fourth edition of the indian news broadcasting awards in this hotel so just want to tell you that on 1st august you will see a new look exchangeformedia.com. I think we should have launched the new look exchangeformedia.com long time back, but you'll see a refreshed exchangeformedia.com, absolutely international in the way uh, content is navigated on it, integrated with social media and whatever you expect and more. Uh, so like you, I look forward to the Exchange for Media Conclave and the new exchangeformedia.com. Thank you for being here and have a great day. Thank you so much.